Good morning, kiddos. I'm just gonna go to the bathroom, but when I get back, we'll start our abusive traumatic experiments. Oh. Oh, you got some stranger things, all right. Oh. No, 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 no! Flush. What, what, Bruce Willis, what did you do? How dare you pull a revenge sis and slaughter all your brothers and sisters? You are grounded, mister. You hear me? Grounded! That was a great D&D game. Yeah, it was pretty wicked. All right, I'll see you chumps tomorrow. I gotta go get some totally legal stuff to give to a cheerleader. There you guys are. Where were you? Oh, we were just having their D&D night with the boys. Better question is, where were you? I was having my big basketball game. That's where you guys were supposed to go to. Oh wait, that was tonight? Yes! Did you not see the sign? Oh. Well, me and my basketball team were about to go do some totally legal drinking. You wanna come? Well, I would, but I kinda have to go to California to visit Bruce Willis, so... Bye! Hey, Eddie. I'm here. Do you have the stuff? Yeah, I got the stuff. Just give me a sec. Hey, wait a minute! Oh my goodness! It's 9.45! It's past my curfew! I better get back home before I get brutally murdered or something! Okay, Chrissy, I got the stuff. Are you ready to go crazy? Chrissy? Chrissy? Cr Chrissy, wake up! I don't like this! Chrissy, w wake up! Bruce Willis! It's great to see you again. How have you been? Oh, it's been great here! I definitely have friends, and Will's been making fire of you and him together! Well, the what? Oh, it's nothing! Uh, shouldn't you get Mike's bags? Oh yeah, of course! Wait, why do we still call her Bruce Willis? She literally has hair now and everything. Shh. It's a running gag. Mary! Ugh, Joyce, what is it? I'm trying to watch DuckTales. I think Hopper is alive! Joyce, didn't you literally see Hopper get obliviated to Ash? He could have plot armor. Okay, but even if he is, how do you know if he's still alive? He's probably really skinny now. Mm. I have a letter here that says, Hopper is alive, meet us at the Russian place and give us 40 grand if you ever want to see him again. Signed by the peanut butter man. Joyce, that just sounds like a scam, and we don't even have 40 smackers to save him. Oh, well I have 40 smackaroos. You have 40 big ones? You were poor in season 1. This doesn't make that much sense, but I'll go along with it. I'll see you in Russia after I finish my karate class. Dang, this place is pretty cool. I love all the random 80s nostalgia references over here too. Hi there, Bruce Willis! <laughs> Oh, hey there, girls! <laughs> You're such a loser! Loser! Hey! I want you to apologize to me! I or what? Are you gonna run home to your dad Hopper and- Oh, wait. He's dead. <laughs> Bruce! Why did you do that? She was being mean and deserved it. 
She's only passed out anyway. She'll be fine. Hmm, yes. She's definitely dead. You killed that skater bitch with a shoe. Okay, I gotta admit, that girl did deserve it, but you're definitely getting locked up for that one, buddy. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. Good afternoon, sir. Would you mind telling me where you were last night? Well, I was just doing some underage drinking and a little bit of drugs. Ah, okay. Well, do you know where Kersey was by any chance? My girlfriend? She said she was going to take her famous 9pm nap. Wait, what does Chrissy have to do with this? Did that D&D virgin hurt her or something? Oh, of course not. Uh, before I go, here's a pamphlet for a funeral that's happening later today. Okay, bye! Well, Murray, here we are! The North Pole, I mean Russia! Hello there, I am Yuri, pleased to meet you. Oh, do slow! <laughs> okay, then do it again. So you got the monies? Yep, right here. Wow, never before I have seen this much American dough. Let me go make the phone call then. We'll be on our way to Hops. Have peanut butter while you wait. So, what's this sitch? Did they bring the monies? Hey, well I got some good news, and some more good news, my comrade. I've drunk them with my peanut butter, and I decided to snitch on you since I get bounty from you then. Money, money, money. What, what the hell, man? You know that snitches get stitches. Heh <laughs> well, where I come from, snitches get bitches. So, what happened? Will I be able to see Joyce? Yeah, <laughs> well, uh, about that. Oh, you son of a bitch! Hey, this isn't a prison. Yes, well, instead of bringing you to the big house, we decided to train you so you'll be overpowered when you fight Vecna. All right. Guess who's back? Back again. What? So you died season one by a dead Corkin! My death was greatly exaggerated. Well, anyway, let's start those experiments! So, you're telling me that we're under house arrest until Bruce comes back from training to be overpowered to stop this Vecna? Yeah, basically. Well, can we at least order some pizza? I don't see why not. Hey, I'll have the, uh... Well, that was fast. Wait a minute, there's anchovies on this pizza. Oh shoot, quick, scatter! Hey, aren't you the muchachos that order pizza without anchovies, dude? Yeah, well, we're ordering it to go! Eddie, Eddie, buddy, you in here? Stand back, all right? If you go one step closer, I swear to God, I'll roll a 30 dice on your ass. Yo, Eddie, we're here to help you. Why would you help me? Everyone in Hawkins thinks I'm a murderer now. Well, we don't. This stuff sort of happened before. Remember the 80s mall? I thought the communists destroyed it. Well, they sort of did, but it was mostly the demons that did it. Yeah, well, if you look over here, if you watch all of these videos, it'll help you understand the situation a lot better. Why the hell do you have a grandfather clock over there? What are you talking about? It's just some poster. Lucas? What are you doing here? Well, I decided to leave my new cool friends since they turned into cool psychopaths who wanted to kill Eddie. What? 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 Yeah, they should be here in like, a few seconds. There you are. You killed my poor girl. Come on, boys. Let's get him. Scanner! Okay, there has to be some perfect, logical, non-sci-fi explanation for this. Hey there, I'm wondering if you know anything about Vecna? Vecna? That's a name I haven't heard in a long time. Well, I first started all the way back in the 1950s. Everything was in black and white and in a 4x3 aspect ratio. Well, lovely family, how are we in our new humble home?
Oh golly, I love this song. It's such a banger. Isn't that right, my darling? Oh, great heavens. My wife is dead. I guarantee it's not what it looks like, chaps. So then they locked me up in this slummer. At least I get a shower once a month and three meals a day. Hmm, alright, that's that's pretty interesting. Pretty pretty juicy stuff there. Hey Billy, I wrote a letter for you. <clears throat> Dear Billy, I am sorry. I don't know why I'm writing this since you're already dead. Yours truly, Mad Max. We should um we should probably help with that. Wow, that was such an inspiring letter. It makes me want to take some poetry classes. Guys, I sort of figured it out. If you play her favorite song, it will stop Vecna. Shoot, does anyone know Max's favorite song? Is, is it this? Don't worry, I know what a real favorite song is, and it's not that. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna enjoy killing you and... Wait... What's that sound playing? Is that just non-copyright music? I mean, it's a really good song. Get back here, you bitch. Uh, where, where are we? I'm pretty sure we're in an aeroplane. Oh, hey, you two are finally awake. We're almost at the prison. I have some peanut butter there in case you're hungry. Jesus, do you have anything but peanut butter? I'm allergic. What? That's my karate chop sound. So wait, if he's a pilot, then who's flying the plane right now? So, can you explain this to me again? I'm pretty sure with the power of my campus, that the gate to the upside down is under that water. Okay, well that seems legit. <laughs> You know what? I got respected. What's up? Meanwhile, in Russia. Damn, now some delicious food. What's happening now? Oh, they said that we had to fight a beast if we wanted to get out of here. Hey, yo, what? Guess who's back? Back again. Over's back. Uh, tell a friend. Guess who's back? <laughs> Snowball fight. Fire! Fire! <laughs> Hopper! What the hell? Oh, come on, Joyce. Pals before gals. Well, look who's finally awake, you silly Billy. I'm back in the goddamn rainbow room! Hey, you see those kids over there? They said that they want to beat you to death, and Papa's gonna let it happen. Hey, what? Yeah, well, I would help you get out of here, but I got this tracking chip in my body that I can't get out. Done. Darn, that was fast. Well, just wait outside for a second. I need to go take care of something. Okay, this is exactly what it looks like, but Bruce, you can join me. Well, no thanks. I don't really want to pull a revenge of the Sith on any of these kids. Well, if you're not with me, then you're against me. Then I'll do what I must. You will try. Um, this really doesn't look that intense. Trust me, when we add all the music and special effects, it'll look 20% better. Uh, uh. What? B B Bruce Willis, what did you do? <gasps> Don't worry, it was just a flashback. But at least you look like Bruce Willis again. Hey, Owen, what's going on right now, buddy? Code Red? <laughs> A code dark red! Oh, rats, we gotta get out of here quick! Okay, we should be safer now. <laughs> hey, Bruce! Mike! What are you doing here? 
Well, we were getting high with our new friend Argyle, but we found you due to plot convenience. Oh, sweet. Well, let's get out of here. Ah! Well, that was sure one rocky journey to her upside down, but if we're gonna go back to kill Vegna, we're gonna need guns. Steve, we live in America. Don't you think it'll be a little hard to get guns here? 12 seconds later. Alright, we got Genj. Now what? Who's gonna banish this wicked beast? Here it is! My sweet baby! Are you all ready to ride? Wait, before we do this, I'm gonna go back and kill that Demogorgon with a sword. <laughs> why It'll look very cool. Okay, we could go now. Well, time to get captured by Vegna. Wish me luck. You. Hey, yo, Jason. Get Max out of whatever satanic you're doing to her. How did you get a gun? Lucas, we live in America. Of course I own a gun. Well, your gun is no match for my knuckle sandwich. Wow. <laughs> hey, Max, how are you feeling? On? Oh, sweet Neptune of Pearl. Hmm. Draining all your life essence is like drinking a juice box. <laughs> it's time for a rematch, bitch. Oh, I've been waiting to whip your ass for the past seven years. Okay, Eddie, now! <laughs> See? What did I tell you? Music makes it 20% better. Oh, you jerk! Dude, that was great! I know, right? And it all worked accordingly to plan. <laughs> no! This is Mr. Hanoff with some breaking news. There is currently massive cracks all throughout Hawkins that are literally opening up a gate to fucking hell, but we are to believe that it is an earthquake instead. In other news, we got characters such as Jonathan that have done nothing in this season besides getting high, and how a local girl, Max, somehow broke all of her bones in her body and is somehow still breathing. Would you mind telling us how you survived all this? Well, it looks to me as if it's due to plot armor. And very special guest, Soldier Boy. Fab Five Freddy told me everybody's fly. DJ spin and I said my my. Hey, well, is that the portrait you made for me? Yeah. I brought back Chinese food. Hey! Yeah, guys, is it snowing outside? This isn't snow. Holy shit. Global warming was real all along? Hey. Do you like lights? Do you like cool lights? Do you like cool lights on Lego sets? Well, in that case, let me introduce you to. Garden of Bricks! The Garden of Bricks is a website where you can get Lego LED light kits that brighten up your sets. Recently, I was able to get a kit from my Daily Bugle, and it came in a neatly packaged box with a nice letter and a code to a website with all the instructions on how to use it, and BOOM! Look at that! That's really cool. And if you don't take my word for this amazing product, here's some others that will also endorse this. Hi, I'm Saul Goodman, and I approve of this message. Hi, I'm Jesus Christ, and this product really brightens up heaven for me. So if you want to get your hands on their amazing lighting kits, make sure to look in the link in the description below to check out their website. <laughs>